So the aim of this workshop is to raise awareness of the mental health that doesn't get spoken about, the mental health that is invisible. And this is what this is about. So first off, uh, why am I doing this? Okay. So when I was younger, I suffered from something called ME, which is chronic fatigue syndrome. It's quite a debilitating disease, as in on my worst days, I was probably awake for two hours a day, and even then walking down the stairs was a struggle, which is hilarious when you think what I do now for a living, right? I'd say it probably took about two years in total to get myself physically better. And I've, you've got to be, I've got to be clear about that, physically better. But over time, you know, dance, turned me into who I am today. I can promise you I'm not thinking about the issues at home when I'm dancing. You don't have to be a dancer to do it. It's so easy to pick up and it's just really, really fun. I just find that it's a great learning environment for me. Um, I'm not a person who would naturally put myself forward or be um, sort of in front of the camera or whatever, but he really brings a personality out of you. He's a really, really good teacher, and there's, it's just a class where there's really no pressure, and you can really learn and push yourself and try new things. And I hit, hey, 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 round and hit and slide, stop. Nice, good, all right, ready. Five, six, yes or no? Yes. Beautiful, go again, five. It's less about getting the moves perfect and it's more about building your confidence and not worrying what people think of you. I saw so many people just, just letting loose and not worrying at all. This morning I was like, I get shower, I get ready, I get breakfast. I was like, no, I'm not going to go. There was the, the, no, I'm not joking. There was the fear inside myself, it was blocking me. I was like, no, you're going to go there, you're going to have anxiety, everybody's watching you, blah, blah, blah. But actually, um, by skipping my fear and being here today and able to talk here, actually I feel better. I really believe in, uh, in the power of dance. Please go and tell me how you feel and what you think and stuff like that. I love you all. Thank you so much. As you can hear, everybody's talking behind, which is incredible because that was the aim of this, is to get people in conversation. I was motivated by the, the openness of a, a class which was about mental health and enabling well-being and really letting people let go of their anxieties and fears, which I think is a big thing for mental health, particularly around performance. So what I got out of it was you know, a freeing up of feeling inhibited or judged or um, anxious about what I was doing and just a, a great sense of well-being in the community. It's just kind of, I don't know, getting me back out into the world, getting me out of my room, getting me out of a negative headspace and I'm really proud of myself as well, the fact that I did it and, and I kind of want to come again, so yeah. <laughs> Brendan just given so much confidence. It was so alive. You know, it starts off quite slow and he gives them the steps, but he, he supports them throughout that class. You got it? Yes? No? And all of that. And they're confident enough to actually answer. And I just want to say a massive thank you for you all for coming today and supporting me. And now we're going to dance. Ready? Yeah. Cool.